Hello, everybody, and welcome to Let's Try. My name is Retromation. This is Froggy's Battle, a skateboarding action roguelike that I'm excited to be checking out here today. It's out now on Steam, and it's under two bucks. So, hey, in we go. We got change direction, jump, and dash slash land. Okay. So we can bump into enemies to hurt them. We can presumably, yep, land on enemies. Can we dash? So dashing is just for safety. We can, like, slam land on him. Okay. Interesting. What on God's green? Okay. Whoop. Interesting. This is, okay. We do a full spin around this big old circle. This is kind of cute. Uh, choose one. Sword that slashes in front of you. Bonus one health. Shoots rocks in front. I mean, I'll take it. Gotcha. So it's like... I can actually sort of uh, aim it from a distance here. Oh my god. Oh boy. So if we press any button... It looks like we can switch our direction. Like pressing left while we're upside down swaps our direction as well. Whoop. Okay, hold on. Get out of here. We kind of want to have a little bit of a distance and just kind of like kite them like this. If we have this slingshot, it seems quite good. Uh, skate point gives skate damage and move speed. Magic point gives magical damage and skate damage. Strength is physical damage and skate damage. I'll pick it. I'm hoping that this... Yeah, it looks like this is physical damage. Okay, hold on. Oh my lord. Kind of like trying to get around this circle here. Is a lot of it. Son of a gun. Kind of want to just like poke at him. We can also slam on top of their, uh, their heads here. But it feels like uh, our slingshot is our most effective tool. Oh, my word. Uh, crit chance, chance of rare upgrades, magical damage, skate damage, attack speed, and projectile damage. Okay. So maybe uh, strength... Maybe strength helped? Maybe it didn't. Okay, let's get out of here with a dash. Ooh. Let's just say that was absolutely on purpose. Oh, get out. I'm glad that we have the invincibility on the dash. Because, boy, we uh, we really need it in this game. <laughs> the fact that we have a projectile that shoots at an arc while we're spinning around in a circle is crazy to me. Not in a bad way. It's just kind of neat. Skate point gives us a bonus magic point. Gotta be honest. Frog or the band? What? Okay, it says what his angle is going to be there. Uh, nope. Yeah, I was going to say, I saw problems there, but I guess if we dashed through and then we ran into him like that, as long as we're not running into him while he's doing his jump, I guess we're fine. Oh! Son of a gun. Kickflip. Choose... Wait, what is this? Landing with this trick deals critical damage to all enemies in range. Classic trick. Your jump becomes a kickflip. Deals damage multiple times. Cool move that always crits. This is cool. I'll do this. Gives us... Uh, oh, no. So we kind of, like, have to get some distance on these guys if we want to use at least our weapon. Oh, my lord. Or some height. Oh! Yeah, I think that maybe just jumping on these guys is going to be a better tool. Yeah. For sure. Our new tricks looks like it does damage on the way down as well. Strength, magic, agility. So it looks like this is uh, both a projectile and physical. You can see down there our equipment, our slingshot. It looks like it's both a uh, physical damage thing and a projectile thing. Oh! 
Go, 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 go. Yeah, and I'm assuming that the little kind of red uh, glow is the spot where if we touch it, we will take damage. Right? Like, so otherwise, enemies are kind of fine to run into, which is nice. Archer Hat shoots arrows in a forward arc, throws multiple juggling balls around. Sure. Two, wait, two times two damage. Forward arc. We already have, like, kind of a forward arc. What? It kind of just genuinely throws it in a wild direction. It's kind of random. I kind of like it for us, though. Destroy this man. Destroy this man. It covers a little bit of a ground that we sort of, sort of need covered. Yeah, we can't really be underneath that guy. How does a man heal? One max HP heals up to two missing HP. Gotcha. That's how a man heals. As if you knew. Oh, no. Okay, we just need to clear out like a little free section of the map for ourselves. Not good. Not good. Get out. Get out. Get out. This is my corner of the map. Thank you. Okay, get away from him when he's doing his slam, and then go in, go ham. Poof! This is no joke. <laughs> go for more physical damage. Brago's the twins. I'm gonna take a hot guess. Yeah, that these guys are just gonna be two of the same guy that we already fought. Kinda glad we have those extra projectiles. Okay, good. Out of the way. I think we want to go where he's going and then, just, yeah, just jump on him. One to strength, magic, agility, and skate and luck. Just one to everything. Critical damage is 4x. It's magical damage. Bonus magical. I mean, crits always being 4x is good for us since we have a guaranteed crit on our slam. Awesome. Just give me healing. Just give me healing. It's all I care about. Agility and skate. I'll take it. Oh, no, no, no. Controlling myself when I'm up in the air, like upside down, up in the air, is really tough. Unsurprisingly, probably. Oh. Throws a bowling ball that rolls around the two. Can I can I have another one? Like genuinely I can have two weapons at once? If so, I guess I'll get a different type of weapon. Uh-oh. Frog! The giant frog is just a normal guy now. I'm gonna be dead in here in a second. For a cute game, this is extremely brutal. Alright. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. That I just walked right into it. Please give me healing. Please give me healing. Yes. Cut. Wham, bam, slam. All right, good deal. Good deal. Look at that bowling ball go. Did somebody just do 100 damage of mine? Good. Back it up, back it up, back it up. If I can get the uh, the little green circular ones out of the way... Ah! Before they start doing damage, that's going to be huge. Definitely going for the healing. Frogo the very bad. Okay, he's just very fast. I feel like I have a relatively good setup for dealing with him. Oh, he summons another pal too, though. Okay, we need to kill the little one before... He gets to do his thing. Go, 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 go. Just stall. Oh, there's so many of them. Good. Good. 
Good, 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 good. Dash out. Get in there. Get in there. I'm almost done. Hey. Oh. Magic and an agility heal one. I mean... I've got, I guess, like a boss going on here? Big boss? I think my projectiles are kind of fantastic for this. But we'll see. Oh! Big numbers! Big numbers! Big numbers! Big numbers! Okay, it's fine. We got enough health to just spam, dude. Okay, this is getting chaotic, though. Just keep on doing trick shots on his arm. You do too many crits. Alright. I won. <laughs> beat the first boss. Oh, beat the twin boss. Deal big okay. Beat the fun. It's fun. I like it. I really like it. It's a sweet little game. I'm gonna play another run here. So there is a hard mode. Do I want to do hard mode? I feel like I want to do a different run to learn what's going on. Truthfully, but... I kind of... Yeah, let's go back to the main menu. We'll just do a normal, another normal run, but we'll try something different. Like, we could try just uh, the normal skate skill. By just, like, upgrading our run into them damage. Spear. Okay. Let's let's do magic actually. Spawn lightning on a random enemy. Ooh, we don't even need to be around him for this. Seems busted. Okay, go, 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 go. Luck, crit chance, chance of rare upgrades. Ooh. Get that little guy. Ooh. And I'm not talking about me. Oh. Weird. Okay, so if we just, like, keep on moving in the same direction as the enemy, we will just keep, keep bumping into them, which is kind of nice. Go for magic damage. It seems like, yeah, it increases our skate damage as well, which is neat. Oh, bad. Bad on my end. Okay, bump. Simple enough. Good. Get in there, get a little bit aggro with it. Oh, my word. Go! Okay. This is, I don't know, it's really fun. I... Okay, strength and agility bonus. I'm going for more luck. I'm going all in, baby. Alright, we can keep bumping into him like this. Be out of here in no time, dude. Alright. If we generally just keep moving in the same direction, it feels like it is easier to process, for sure. On this fight. Cut. Super fast flip that summons lightning and deals magical damage. Yes. Ooh. So yeah, it scales off of uh, magic damage, I guess, is the kind of the big thing. Does 13. Oh, get out of there. Okay. Bye-bye, nerd. Give me more magic damage, please. I guess I'll just keep on taking luck. But we know the run's not that long, so it's like... We don't want to invest too heavily. Okay. Does this just never stop? Okay, he does stop. He stops eventually. Just want to kick flip over his head. Again, like when we're up here is when we have a hard time. Magic hat. Bonus HP. 
Uh, spawn fireballs that go directly upward. Yes. Oh, that's crazy to use. Alright. We can definitely find a way to use it, though. It's like mostly... I rotated wrong. Okay, good. It's mostly going to be used on accident, I would say. The fireball. Ooh, or if I just get, like, underneath the guy like that. It's going to be nice on, like, the final boss. Yeah, it's... It's hard to use it on purpose, I will say. Hmm. Uh, it looks like apparently the fireball is a projectile. You can see down kind of like... Woo! By the symbol in the bottom left in the equipment. Okay. I think I'm gonna die soon. I'm gonna die very quickly here. I'm, I'm almost dead. Seems like the best way to play the magic build would be to be very, very passive. Oh my god. Yeah. It rewards us quite well for just kind of like... Not being around them. But I also have never... Like, I have two magic upgrades. Okay, there we go. It's gotta hit somebody. I'm dying. I have to go with this. Open a chest that has three rare upgrades. Oh, the twins. I'm dead. Like, not this second, but not not this second. Okay. The skate damage is doing, like, a little bit more of my damage than I'd like. Okay. This boss is not that bad. I feel like the fireballs are kind of coming in handy on this. Which is cool, because it is... It can be tough. Strength and magic now each boost both magical and... Okay. It's kind of fun. I don't have any strength right now. You know what? Whatever. It's good. But, let's buff up everything. That was nice. These guys are really easy for us. Oh, double magic upgrade. There we go. Okay. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay. Now we need to go in and go ham. Go, 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 go. 22 damage. Bowling ball plus magical damage. I'm going to go for the fire run. Creates big fire. Ooh, behind us? Oh, that's wacky. Oh, that's wacky. Oh, that's so wacky, trying to trying to aim the butt fire in this. Oh, there's an enemy under there! I'm dead here. This is too much. Unless the butt fire. Alright, we're fine. We're fine for now, but I am going to die after this if I don't get my act together. Yep. Yep. There it is. R.I.P. I do want to try it again. I want to try... Kind of want to try the magic build again, if I'm going to be real. Shield, give one shield per round that prevents the first hit froggy takes. Instead of any... Interesting. Instead of a weapon. Okay. Dig it. Maybe I can actually get magic stat now. That'd be cool. 
I don't love the magic kickflip too much. But it's like, what's the other option, I guess? I don't, know, I don't know if there's one. We do know that... Um, there are at least... Bare minimum, there are some projectiles that are half magic, half uh, projectile. So, like, agility and magic scaling. Okay. Let's get this guy out of the way. Gonna be nice and easy to kill. Ooh. Yeah, the magic is, like, it's a little bit more passive. Which I guess, like, a lot of times magic can be that way in games. More magic. Alright, the fact that I already have three magic is fantastic compared to the last time. I feel like I probably should have been hit by that, but I'm not going to be upset. Cool. Oh my god! Destroyed. All right. Yep. It's fine. We'll, we'll, we'll keep using it. I mean, it's another way to get magic scaling. It also does a lot more damage now, so it's feeling a little bit more... ...justifiable. Two kick flips and we got him. I'm getting the hang of it. You need to get your sea legs on this one. Sure. This one being this game. Ooh. So yeah, we need to like kickflip over him. To do like true damage. Eh, they're a little bit too close together. Whoa! Uh, bonus skate. Blast musical notes that hit close by enemies. Or the magic hat. I'll go for this. Ooh! If we wanted to do the, um... Like, the skate magic combo again. Seems like a good one for it. It's a lot of notes. Can each one hit an enemy? Ay, ay, ay. I slam down. You can't... I always... A thing that's making me take damage more than others is... When you press the dash button. The button to do this in the air. It does the slam down. And that... It's understandable. It is like... It's what it said on the tin that it was going to do. But it is tripping me up. Good. Get out of there. This guy sucks. Okay. I will tell you, yeah, getting, actually getting the stats to do a magic build feels way better. Okay. Never mind. It sucks. I just. Okay. Back it up. Back it up. I'm hurting. I would take a heal. Thank you. Progos the twins. Okay. I feel like the music notes would be pretty good here. Nice. Uh -oh. oh! The fact that they were going at the same time, I was just looking at the other guy. They're getting faster. Strength and magic now both each boost each other. Spawn fire that deals magical damage while moving. All right, I'll tell you what. I will get the smart and strong thing now since we do have... All right. Okay. It is interesting how... Not having that, um, that other fireball that we had before... Does make these guys a lot tougher, though. They were not... They were very easy before. Skate and luck. I'm gonna get strength. I'm gonna be crazy with it. So we can, like, mow down enemies, theoretically, now. Just, like... Running into them should be pretty good. This wave has so many enemies. Yeah! A man from the ceiling got me. Medium range weapon that poke enemies. 
Okay. Okay. Uh, this is hell. Yeah! Got out of there. So the thing is, my, my spear has been upgraded by my magic. It's not just the, uh, the alternative, you know? The spear hits behind me, too. Aye! This is... This, this room is hell. Okay. Back it up, back it up. Come on, spear. Woo! Health, please. Or not. Oh, no. Big man gonna be problem. Little man gonna be problem. Uh, I'm probably... I could see myself being dead in this... Yeah, I could easily see myself being dead in this room. This is crazy. I missed my projectiles. Projectile run, I think, was the right call. Wow! That is that. Unlocks a new trick, the ninja flip. That is brutal. This is very cool, though. I really, really like it. Uh... Unlocks hard mode. I got it. Yep. Beat hard mode. Beat hard mode without losing a heart. Game too easy. There you go. Die 10. I swear I almost got it. You get a new hat. The helmet. Achieve very high DPS when with two shields. Helmet counts when in less than five minutes. Hard mode in less than seven. So there you go. I, I gotta admit, though, for like a little... Let's just go into hard mode just for a few minutes here. Just to kind of see what it looks like. Uh, The game is... You gotta remember, it's a two-buck game. Like, it's two bucks. It's currently on sale for even less than that. It's good. It's good for that. Um, But yeah, I'd, I'd say that the slingshot build definitely seemed like the uh, way to go. Getting all those, but... Man, I don't know. I hope that, um, I hope this gets developed even further. Like, I know it's like, it's always, when you, there's a little, little tiny game, you know, it's like, I, I want more, I want more. But like, I think that the proof of concept of this is really sweet. And I think a lot of people could really like it. I will say it takes a lot of getting used to initially with the, um, with the movement. But then when you get it, it's really not that bad. But... I, yeah, like, I think it's just learning that there's, you know there's not contact damage, but it's hard to bring yourself to get into melee range to do that kind of damage anyways. Oh boy. So it looks like enemies probably, there's more enemies. Go through the screen and deal criticals with your non-projectile hits. Oh my lord. Yeah, that's... This is crazy talk. It seems really dangerous. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, you also only have three health on this mode. Yeah, I gotta... I gotta farm up my, uh... My deaths for the, uh... The death achievement. Somebody hit me. Somebody... Somebody hit me. I'm trying to... <laughs> some, somebody hit me. Or not. It's too good. But, yeah. All right. Really, really neat game. I'm just going to check it out for a little bit here. I don't want to spoil too much of it because I, I I want you to go pick it up for two bucks. I like it a lot. Go check it out. Froggy's Battle. It's a sweet little game. Dang. Uh, is there a ton there? It's hard to say. But I think it's, you know, it's worth the price. It's very much worth the price for sure. Uh, I'll probably be playing this in the morning just as a, like a little loose, goofy game. You know, in the roguelike space. Uh, I don't know. Maybe I'm just uh, not... Maybe I'm just bad at magic builds. But hey, I like it. I like it. I like it. I like it. The projectile builds seem like a good way to go. Uh, and there's a hard mode if it's too easy and some extra achievements for you to clear if that is too easy. Uh, alas, alas, that's that, though. That's going to do it here for today for Froggy's Battle. There's a link in the top description if you want to check out this game for yourself. Like I said, I do recommend it. It is currently on sale for... Music is going to pause there.
Okay, it's on sale for $179. If the uh, price of $2 is a little bit too rich for you, then go pick it up right now with the link in the top description. Like I said, though, my name is Retromation. I cover indie games every single day with an extra specialty in roguelikes and roguelites. That is something you are into. This is a channel that you should be subscribed to. Thank you, thank you, and I'll see you next time. Bye.